Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make a registration form and login form using PHP and CSS. Here's the login form. I also added an error handling. Okay, now we're registered. Session already started. We're logged in as Bob. We're going to log out and then uh, log back in. I'm not going to type this all out because it would take too long. I'm just going to show you the source. And uh, it'll soon be up on rrpower.com for the source files. So the first thing we're going to do is include the functions file. And then we're going to start the session. And we're going to get the username, the session username. And then uh, we're going to include the style sheet. Uh, for this page and then uh, this is just the head and then we uh, call that PHP function right here which I show you on the functions page and then uh, this is just the content we just show underneath the head you guys can put whatever you want okay this is the uh, registration page and uh, it's basically the same as the uh, index page uh, we include the functions file and then we start the session and we get the username and then we include the uh, styles style sheet and then uh, in the head we call the uh, PHP function right here and what this is going to do is this is just going to display if the user is logged in or not and then uh, this right here is the form this is the title of the form. This is our error from the PHP file. And then this is the uh, username text. You can change this to whatever you want. And then this is the field for it. Input field right here. And then the uh, submit button. You guys can. Uh, style however you want. I just did it to look good for this uh, tutorial. Okay, and then uh, here's the login page. It's uh, basically the same as the registration page. We uh, include the functions file, start the session, get the session username, and then we include the style sheet, call the PHP function, and then this is the form. Here's the form title, error message, input fields for the username, password, and then the form button. Okay, this is the uh, connection view of the uh, server. And uh, this is where you're going to put your username, your password, and your database name. And uh, this file is called uh, connect. Just make sure you uh, include all these files in the same folder. Okay, this is the uh, functions file. We include the connection to the server. And then we're going to, this is the function that we call on all the pages, the log and registration. And we're going to begin the username. Okay, and what we're going to do is we're going to check if the session is registered, the ID, session ID. If it is, we're going to display this in the head file, the head div, and it's going to say welcome username. Uh, we're going to display a link to the home page and a logout link to the uh, logout page. 
and then we're gonna redirect them to the uh, home page right here and if they're not registered then we're gonna destroy the session and we're gonna display home link login link and register link And then uh, this is for the uh, form. Uh, this is the posted values that we're going to collect from the form. Uh, we're going to strip the slashes, and then we're going to strip the tags. And then we're going to check to see which form is submitted. Uh, if this, is, if the posted for the login form, then we're going to hash the password and then we're gonna check to see if that password and username match in the database and then we're gonna count how many rows that we selected from here and then I'll tell you what we're gonna use that for in a minute and then uh, we're gonna check if the username is empty then we're gonna display an error Password's empty, we're gonna display an error. And then this is the log check, which is right here. If it equals one, which means the user exists, which means the password and username match, then we are gonna select from the database the user's information, the ID, username. Then we're gonna set, register the session ID, and register the session uh, username and then we're going to redirect them to the index page, the home page. And if they're not, if it doesn't equal one, if it equals zero, which means there's no results, the password and username don't match, then we're going to give them an error, tell them that their password and username is incorrect. And then this is the check if the register registration form is posted. And if that's posted, then we're gonna to check to see if the user exists in the database already. Right here, number of rows. And then we're gonna see if the username field's empty. If it is, we're gonna give an error. If the password's empty, we're gonna give them an error. If the username exists in the database, which would be one number of rows that we're gonna give them an error because if it already exists, we don't want them creating another one if somebody else already has a username. So if it equals zero, which means it doesn't exist in the database, then we're gonna we're gonna hash the password, create an ID, and insert it. We're gonna insert all their information, ID, username, password, and then this if if this is a success, then we're going to start the session and then we're going to redirect them to the uh, home page. And that's it for the functions. And, uh, if you're wondering more about functions, you can uh, look on uh, look it up on Google for uh, PHP functions. And this is the style sheet. You can style this to whatever you want. I'm just gonna leave it here a minute so you guys can see it all. This is uh, HTML body. Uh, this is the clear, for the divs. Uh, this is the links. You guys can change these colors to whatever you want. Uh, the head style. The content is just the uh, text I have under the head you guys can put whatever you want under that uh, and the reg registration form which is for both the uh, login uh, let's just do that yeah that's just the form that's for both forms um, the form title the text that's for both forms too the input field you can change those Style them to whatever you want.
platform button, and then the air, you can change that to whatever color you want to. And that's about it. Thanks for watching, and uh, please subscribe.